because these things, maybe they weren't as noticeable in the past, but we certainly notice them now. Um, it's, it's, it's common. And we see this big wave coming at us. If we don't prepare for it, it's gonna wipe us out. And then people are gonna finally realize, hey, there's a problem with everything. Um, we don't want that to happen. We don't wanna be the school that gets wiped out. Um, so as a school, we're doing our best to put up sandbags to stop this thing, protect the school. Um, but someone like Goldie and me coming in um, is such a such help for us because they're putting up they're putting up more and more sandbags, you know, for us that are that's going to stop that wave from hitting. Us. What I've done is I've built an organization with a set of very very um, renowned doctors. So Dr. Wayne Lowe, Dr. Richard LaBelle, Dr. Um, Dr. Lance Dome, who've actually overseen the curriculum, trained the trainers, built the system so it is repeatable in different settings and different forums to address everywhere from child to adult. You're right, when students have issues, yeah. and we have to make sure that they really are connected with the professionals yes. who have the training yeah. and yes. the experience. So a lot of other organizations have already recognized that this is a worthy cause. It's, it's, it's worth um, investing time and money. And then you look at who's involved. I mean, she's just amazing at the caliber of people that she's engaged to, to make things happen, to have the programs, to get the facilities, to uh, put on all the events, to do the outreach. Of course, I think the biggest point is that being introduced to the Boldly Me community um, is something that I want to support. I feel a real connection. Just going and being there can be, mean a lot to people around you. I honestly was surprised at the results we got, but it really opens a lot of people's eyes, I think. I, one event one day made a really big difference. And to be a part of it and, and help that to bloom and grow up. You know, I've always been involved in groups like the PTA, et cetera. Um, at the same time, I, my, my time is very limited, so I, I have to be selective. And I, I feel a real connection here that I can give to this community, and I can also learn a lot from all the other people involved. But we all are looking for that all the time. We all are looking for acceptance of who we are inside, who we are as people. And if you don't find it, then you act out. And we see too many people in our society acting out in bad ways, not because they think that they're inherently a bad person, but because they're hurting inside. Those people need bullying.